Hello, this is Calvin and this is my Kink BMX bike. All right, we got the uh, clear ODI Samurai grips made by Kink BMX with the ODI rubber. Yeah, I got the stickers on the inside of the bars. You can see them when your hands are off. It looks kind of cool, something a bit different. 9.5 rise Grizzly bars, the Kink BMX ones. Nice and high. I cut them down like quarter inch either side. We've got the Kink top load stem, 48 millimeter reach or something. It's not too bad, I think they do a 53 millimeter reach as well. Something a bit wider, but I have a little bit tucked in. Down to the forks, I got the Kink CST forks. They've got a cast invest, dropout, good offset on them. Not exactly sure what the offset is, but they're pretty good. I got the Kink 2.4 sever tires. Uh, I've been running them for about a year and they're fucking awesome. I like the wider tires, just more traction. Kink BMX uh, plastic pegs, plastic hub guards to match. Brawler kink rim, front and rear. Laced up to uh, kink front hub and in the back we have a Cinema FX2. Kink stealth pedals, plastic bearingless design, pretty cool slip on slip off. Pillar cranks, 175, 28 tooth uh, bedlam sprocket. Halfling chain, Kink BMX hide seat. The stealth seat design is basically putting the bolt underneath so you're not seeing the bolt on the top of the seat. So it makes for a clean seat look. And then we come to the frame, we have the Kink Mud Runner and a 21, soon to be known as the backwards frame. It's been a good uh, three years running that frame, but uh, the bikes are getting shorter, so it's getting harder for the taller guys to hold on to the back end. The back ends are getting so short, so if you're taking jumps, you're always looping out. So I try and get a frame that has a longer back end. I keep my uh, top tube at a 21. I don't like it too long, but I try and uh, make sure my head tube angle is a little spaced out so it brings the wheels a little bit more apart. There's never any issues. It's always, this thing's true and true, so. Yeah, we're currently on the uh, Vans Dragon Tour in Malaysia. Uh, we're just in Korea, South Korea, Seoul. The first day of this tour I fell and actually broke a bone in my hand or in my wrist, so I haven't been able to ride at all. Yeah, so I'm gonna basically give my bike away There'll be some kid out there that needs a bike and we'll make sure that this bike goes to that kid. Information on any of these parts, just go to kinkbmx.com. Everything's up there, the website's looking amazing right now. Super clean, super easy to use. Jump on there and uh, yeah, shop around too. There's a bunch of stuff for sale. Click the buttons.